Raj from Car Dis Security here. Welcome to the channel. Today we have our first car and coffee meet at the all new Car and Security showroom in Hayes. This meet has been organized by Sean from Ren11 and we have 100 cool Porsches on site. Everything from 70s air cooled all the way up to 991 GT3s. Now, we're gonna show you what's in the car parks and we're also going to speak to some of the owners of the cars they can obviously give us an idea of the journey that they've had with their car the modifications they've done to the car so watch this First car we're going to look at this gorgeous 993 on my left hand side belongs to Andy. Andy's here. We'll have a chat with Andy and he can talk to us about what he's done to the car and what the plans are. Andy, over to you. Raj. Thanks for coming. Thank you. Talk to Thank me about this car. Thing. Wheels, the livery, the decals, the stance. What have you done? Um, well, yeah, I've had it a couple of years. Yep. Uh, it's a Carrera 2. Uh, come over from Germany many years ago. Um, it was pretty much standard when I bought it. Okay. Uh, Hence why it's left-hand drive. Hence, yeah, left-hand drive. And you're happy drive. with left-hand drive? Yeah, I love left-hand drive. Okay. Yeah. Uh, it's no sunroof, LSD. It's got all the right bits and bobs on it. It's a okay. standard car. Um, wheels, I nicked off a J from players. Yes. yes. Managed to prize them out of his hands. Um, that was a few months ago. Uh, I've had the ducktail on a while. Okay. Uh, that's been there, but then I had this mad idea to put some decals on it this year. Just I, a bit I of love summer the, fun. I love so. the decals. Yeah. Very sort of retro look to the yeah. car. So Hopefully you guys would agree with that as well. <laughs> Suspension. Don't, let's not go there. Okay, let's not go there. <laughs> let's not go there. That's what he said. Let's I've not go there. I've got some KW, KW3s. They're actually in the post now. Okay. Um, so so suspension yeah. 2B is going to be KW. Yeah, it will be, yeah. At the moment, it's just standard shocks and some eBay springs of all things. Okay. But it sits all right and it drives all right. Nothing wrong with but eBay. But it's going to be a lot better. Yeah. Okay, Andy. Yeah. Thanks. Fantastic looking car. Thanks for cool, your time. Thanks, thanks for coming. Cheers, mate. Boom. Thank you. Billy, talk to me about the car, the stance, it just looks fantastic. So, the car's a 1995 C2, but in 99 it was sent to Gembala to be basically chopped up. Side skirts fitted, rear oh, yes. spoiler. Yes, yes. All the wings, are, uh, rear quarters are cut up. It was owned by someone about 10 miles away from me for a long time, but they didn't look after it. I rescued it, it needed painting. I've had the whole car painted. Um, KW's recently fitted. Uh, the period correct Gembala wheels, yep. really hard to find. GT3. Front end, 996 Club Sport Lip. Yeah, I love that. That's that's proper low though as well. I don't yeah, know how it's you hard work. And, uh, with that low. It's lost lift. a few screws, so it's a bit flexible now. Yep. Um, and then, yeah, just basically refining the car. Next thing to do is the interior. It's getting a bit tired, needs a retrim. That's next on the cards. You're going to keep those seats? You're going to change the seats? So there's a, they're a really rare option for the 94 year, where okay. they're bigger bolsters on the side. So okay. I'm probably going to keep them, or maybe do SPG or pole positions, I don't know. I don't really get on with them because I'm quite tall, but we'll see. But other than that, I'm just kind of getting it to... Love the stance. Uh, it, uh, tell me, who's the better driver, you or Sarah? Be uh, careful, it's Sarah's here. It's a good job she's not here. <laughs> she is uh, here. <laughs> she, to be honest, she is the better driver. There we go, guys. Sarah is a better driver. Well done, Sarah. That gets me a lot of brownie points, Alex. <laughs> but yeah, Billy, no. Thank awesome. you for coming. Thank you. Appreciate the time. We've got to be short and sweet because obviously we've got quite a few cars here. Thank you for uh, having us. And awesome. on to the next one. Cheers, Willie. Cheers. So Jay, talk to me. What a car! Thank What's you. happened? I know when I saw this car stock, it looked good. It, in fact, it looked impressive. But now you've just created an animal. Talk to me. What, what have um, you done? Yes, yeah, so I got it about. I think it's nearly three years ago, and it was perfect when I bought it. It was C2, low mileage, yep. uh, black on black, which is what I wanted. And then, yeah, I just got carried away with it. Yeah, as, as we I all do. Yeah, as I do with everything I own, and yeah. So yeah, it's had full ITB conversion, full interior. That's Regal Autosport, yeah? Yeah, so AT power, bodies, Regal did the build, yep. uh, wave track diff, RSS engine mounts, uh, RS clutch, everything, basically. Everything you pretty much can do has been done. Seats, 
Interior. Yeah, seats, interiors, full Alcantara, everything, headlining, pillars, dash. What are the seats have? The seats are Cobra. Okay. Um, I always get them wrong. They're either an Imola or a Nagaro. Sure. And then we did uh, a colorway to kind of represent the, you know, you get the tri-color in the RSs. Yeah, on the I RSs, wanted to do yeah. that yeah, yeah. in the cool. yellow. CAE shifter, uh, high go cage, Kinesis wheels. Suspension? That's on Bilstein's. Bilstein's, okay. And are we all done or is there still more to um, go? It's all done for the moment. Okay. Um, I probably will go 3.8. Okay. It's still a 3.6 at the moment. Right. But a 3.8 on the bodies takes it up. It's that'd be, serious. That'd be crazy. That'd be crazy. Have you dynoed this? Yes, yeah, it's been dynoed. Yeah, yeah. And do you know what it's. So uh, this is making 301. It's a lot is, of power. It's only 40 more than standard. Yeah, 40. But it feels like 100. It's a small, narrow body, nimble car. Yeah. It's light. You've obviously reduced a bit of weight. You might have added a little bit, so you might be actually a stock weight. Yeah. But the fact you've got another 40 bhp in a narrow body car, and these cars drive like like they're on rails. I can imagine this just shifts. So uh, it's, it's like fully geoed, um, in canal system, GT3 sort of center exit. So yeah, it's it's kind of where I want it, and yeah, I'm looks happy the part. With it. Looks the part. Jay, thanks for coming. No problem. Thanks for your time. Cheers, yeah, man. man. Sean from Ren 11, hey man. who has organized this event, uh, the handsome bearded fella. So, Sean, talk to me about Ren 11 and talk to me about this gorgeous 997 you got. Thank you. Well, next to you. I'll get to the 997 in a moment, but um, Ren 11 started out in 2019. The whole idea behind it was to bring everyone who loves Porsche together, whether it's standard, whether it's modified, and everything in between. Uh, I want to run a, 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 a how do I say this, uh, a following that doesn't uh, deal with any sort of negative bullshit. Okay. And, you know, apologies for the swear words, but it's so important here. Okay. You know, I like positive vibes. And we can all agree that even if you look at today with the, the, the breadth of the Porsches here, this is exactly what I want. Yeah, the to community. Bring together. Yes. Yeah, it's a community aspect to it as well. And Ren 11 has grown massively. We're almost at 30,000 followers now. Fantastic, and, uh, well done. But it's all organic. But more importantly, it's driven by the people that are talking, communicating, meeting up, making new friends. I love it. Good man. Fantastic. He can talk as well. So I'm going to have to cut him short because otherwise this video could be like two hours long. So, oh, and I could also be a uh, you know presenter on this as well. Who knows? Yeah. Sean, talk to me about the 997 and that colour. Talk okay. to me. So this is CSR Bill 37. Uh, okay. So done by RPM Technic. Um, they do an extensive change on the chassis um, and also internally in the engine in order to uh, make, basically make the car a track ready weapon. Sure. But it's usable for the road. Um, the car itself has had genuine GT3 front and rear bumpers added. The car has been painted in Gulf blue. Okay. Um, again, it's a classic Porsche colour when you consider that. You've also got the highlights in orange with the CSR logo and the Porsche logo in grey. We've got HRE wheels on this and 19 inch uh, as well. Um, and they've been painted in the same grey as the vinyl cover in there. But yep. the key thing on this is it's covered in a protective spray called Ingenco. 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 Okay. So it's, think paint protection film, yep. but not laid, sprayed. So literally you just spray it on. Correct, yeah. And just leave it to set. 
Yeah, in effect, it's, it's a three-stage pro three process. Okay. So what you do, you put a rubberized base coat, first of all. Yep. Secondly, you put a stabilizer layer. And lastly, you just put a layer of uh, top coat, lacquer, and that's it. You bake it like as you would do at each stage, yep. uh, like paint. And then you have a hard-wearing, well, it's a coating that you can't see is on there. The entire car is covered in this. So it's a protective coating, but not a film. Correct. Also, another thing that offers is over 200 microns worth of coating. When you consider Expel, do yep. 8 to 10 uh, microns. Okay. We're already talking a huge amount of, 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 of coating there, and it really does work. The most important part it is a sacrificial coating, but the most important part is protecting the original paint of the car. And this is what this does in an excellent way. And it's pretty cost effective too when you consider Fantastic. the price of equivalent paint yeah. protection films. Fantastic. So, guys, make sure you give Ren 11 a follow. Give Injection, Injenko, sorry. Injenko UK. Give Injenko UK a follow. And uh, again, Sean, thanks for organizing. Well done, man. Thank you, brother, for hosting me. Thank man. you. Cheers, Raj. Thanks for coming. No Talk worries. to me about this car. So, what is it? It's uh, a 72 911 uh, that's been built to a 73 RSR uh, Hurley Haywood tribute. Uh, I mean, it is pretty much a 70s race car for the road, uh, set up on um, with coilover suspension, rose jointed, it's got a, three, a modified 3.2 under the hood, an ATR raised fuel cell. Uh, it was built back in Japan and uh, I've just started to now take the build, put my touch to it, sure. add that element, gone that through That yadness, yes. Yeah, that, you know, gonna put that little bit of, <laughs> yeah. little signature touch to it. So, first things I've just done uh, uh, a re-interior trim. Uh, Simon at PF911 Interiors has done that and done a phenomenal job. Fitted in RSR period correct uh, seats, yeah, uh, and then added awesome. my little touch with the Schroff uh, red racing harnesses, just to add that little pop to the interior. Okay. Um, and yeah, got got the CB covers on there on the original CB lights. They look, um, they look awesome. I've got to say, and proper oh, period correct. Period yes. correct. Yes. And then look at it. All that stone rash, the okay, So Yad has rocked killed. up this morning. I'm like, I don't wash no cars. Dude, look at the state <laughs> of your rims. Give them a clean. He's like. This is a go car. It's a race car. I'm not cleaning it. It's peppered with bugs. Bugs that he's destroyed on the it's, journey, Dan. But this car doesn't look right clean. It yeah. has to be dirty, covered in all the bugs, stone rash, as if you're just taking it off the track and uh, rocked up at an awesome event. So, well, what can I yes. say? What can I say? This is just fantastic. Thank you for coming, brother. Thank you very much. And for, uh, your, for yourself, Carl, the security and uh, Sean Ren 11. Brilliant, thank you for having me. Love Cheers this car, guys. love this car. I don't know how many years this car has been on the scene, but it's always one that I've put right up there. So, Matt, nice to meet you. Thanks yeah. for coming down. Yeah, no worries, Talk man. to me about your gorgeous green. <laughs> what color shade of green well, is it? It's forest green metallic. Okay. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, luckily I bought this car like 10 years ago now. So before the, uh, the sort of 964 boom, if yep. you like. And, uh, yeah, snapped it up for a really good price at the time and just it's been my uh, labour of love if you like just you know modifying it slowly using it regularly it was my daily for a year and a half i put fifteen thousand miles on it in in that time he's not messing around so man. he's not messing li around literally just filled it full of crap and used it as a car which is always quite good that's that's what it's about you know using cars for what they were intended yeah. So, talk to me about the suspension, the wheels, the ducktail, what have you done? Yeah, so, um, I, well, the wheels are original Porsche Eater Beta um, split rims. 17s, yes? Which, 18s. 18s, 18 um, okay. But they've been widened with stainless steel dishes and, uh, and also machined to give me a bit more clearance on okay. the arches. Yep. So, I've actually got 225 tyres up front, which is a bit wider than you'd normally see on these sure. cars. Um, and then, uh, yeah, pretty pretty big out back. Um, suspension is KW Variant 1, um, but um, my mate uh, Milestone 71 did some custom spring rates for me, sure. so could get it a bit lower, and uh, still it's, it's lovely, it rides really nice, and yeah, comfort and, and lows, really. And I'm loving the ducktail, I yeah, love this. Yeah, so ducktail, eBay special. Is it really? 200 quid. It looks so, uh, yeah, <laughs> snap that up. Um, uh, got it painted and you know it's, it does the job changes up the look so yeah right matt thank you for coming yeah no worries man lovely car yeah nice see to you see soon. you mate cheers Take thanks cheers you.